How often does somebody get charged for attempting or uh, conspiring to kidnap a governor? It just doesn't happen. So because of that significance, it's a huge case. Opening statements got underway Wednesday. It's in the trial of four men accused of planning to kidnap Michigan Governor Gretchen Whitmer. Prosecutors say the men were angry over COVID-19 restrictions she put in place. Defense attorneys say no such plan existed and that the defendants were targeted by federal agents for their anti-government views. The high profile case made jury selection a difficult process. I understand that some people might not like Governor Whitmer, and I understand that some people might love Governor Whitmer. But the issue is, is as the judge said in this case, this isn't a polling place. This is a courthouse. And the issue is, no matter how you feel about the governor, did these defendants violate the law in the way that it's charged? And that is really the question that is in front of us. It is important to note six people were initially charged in the alleged kidnapping plot. Two have fled guilty and are expected to testify for the prosecution.